Hey guys, Derek here for Auto Group. You guys ready to go through a Durango 326 RLT? It's coming up here in just a sec. Derek here, you're obviously looking for your next RV. If you have any questions or have or need any advice, hit me up at the number below. I'd love to assist you in your journey ahead, and let's get back to it. Good morning, everyone. This is Derek here with Furrow Auto Group. Today, I'm walking you through on this 2025 Durango 326 RLT. It's a brand new floor plan in the lineup. I can't wait to show you the inside, but right now, I'm going to go over the boring stuff. 3011 total length, 11,000 dry, 13,000 loaded. It was 76 gallon fresh, 50 gallon gray, 50 gallon black tank tankless on-demand water heater and sleep six comfortably until you start improvising. As you can see on the front cap, it's painted instead of your gel cap. That way you don't have to worry about any fading in the future and your two LED strips on the front. Moving right along to the side here, you see your two of your three slide outs. This one being the king size bed slide out. Right under you have your updated four point auto leveling system with a cap on the front of the touchscreen, so you don't have to worry about any environmental damage in the future. Moving over here, you have your first cap for your full pass-through storage. That drop frame construction gives you that full storage. I have it in the picture. Take a look at it. I really invite you to take a look. Speaking of inviting, I invite you to take a look at this in person. That way you can make sure this fits all your wants and needs. Videos and pictures never do anything justice. I really encourage you to come experience it for yourself. Moving right along to the back here, you have your ladder going up to your full one panel roof, going up also to your 440 watt total off-grid solar system with a 2K watt inverter as well as you have your two 15k btu ducted roof acs you have a hitch here prepped for 3,000 pounds tow 300 tongue weight moving over here is your third slide and the hatch to your outdoor griddle take a look at that let's go ahead and move on over into the inside as you can see right here full really nice comfortable kitchen here you have solid countertops instead of your normal thermofoil you have a nice little dinette for everyone to eat breakfast or you can eat breakfast in this huge living room stainless steel appliances all around full 12 volt fridge like your residential fridge keep everything nice and cool instead of room temperature you have your two fold out couches here for those extra sleeping you have a wide fireplace a wide tv and your two thomas Paine recliners that have heated and massaging. Take a look at all this space. Let's go ahead and move on in over to the bedroom and the bathroom. As you can see, it's prepped, uh, it's actually equipped with the tire pressure monitor systems already, so you don't have to worry about that in the future. Over here, you have your panel that controls all your slides, your lights, everything like that, and your first thermostat. Thermostat is in the bedroom. I'll, take, I'll show you the other the one in here in just a sec. Moving to the bathroom, you have your two sink countertop with your full solid countertop as well, stainless steel sinks, porcelain toilet, and your one panel shower. Tons of room in here. Moving over into the bedroom here. You have a lot of room to walk around your king size bed here. Lights above, that way you have comfortable reading. Your second thermostat, as I mentioned earlier, and moving over into the closet here. Tons of storage as the cap it's molded with the cap, and that way you don't have to worry about flat storage and running out of room. Look at this. Super deep. Speaking of storage, take a look at the storage under the bed. Tons of room down there. If you take these baskets out, your cat will love it. I know my cat, Mason, would. And moving on into the closet over here. More room, and it's prepped with washer dryer. And as you can see, you have your blackout shades. That way you're not silhouetting at night. Let's move on back over here. Get a nice view, panoramic view of the whole inside again. Tons of space, very homey. Let's move on back out. 